Sesa, aka Waffle Boss, is a student at the University of the West Indies and he also whips up a tasty waffle for his customers. Let's hear more about his catering service in this week's Next Generation feature. Next Generation is brought to you in partnership with Kingston 62 Rum. My name is Alwin Bisesa. I'm a second year biomedical engineering student at the University of the West Indies. I own and operate WTF, that's Wayne's Tailored Foods, here on the campus. All right, so the idea for WTF came about when I was in high school, around third or fourth form. So what happened was that I had a few friends who had to stop coming to school because of financial problems. So back in school, I used to hustle, not because I needed to, but because of them. I would hustle, buy a few things and sell. And I found that I could actually sell things at school. So I started cooking from home and delivering to school. And that's where it kind of originated from me making food from home. Mm -hmm. I am from Clarendon, um, Four Pass more specifically. I attended Foundation Preparatory School and then moved on to the Glenmere High School and currently here at the University at West Indies. Officially, I guess you could say the business has been around three years now, even though I've been practicing and serving food for at least five years. I did short courses online, free courses online, but apart from that, no formal training. The support so far has been fairly well. Um, I've been getting support from a number of persons here on, on campus who have known me, uh, friends. A lot of advertising has been going on thanks to persons from the guild, etc. So, so far the support on the business is really well. Because I'm just focusing here on here um, at the students on campus. So where my support comes from is just here and advertising the same thing, just everything here on campus right now. My specialty is waffles. So I do waffles of different kinds and varieties, styles and textures. So I do regular Belgian waffles. Uh, you can choose whether you want them to be baked or you want it to be a butter or you want it something similar to a cookie dough. Or if you're working out, you can tell me, say, okay, you know, I want this with X, Y, Z amount of protein or I want this in there or you want a rum cream. Everything I, I do, I do it specially tailored to fit your needs and everything is made from scratch. The waffles, I made them so that you can have them for breakfast, lunch and dinner. Uh, so in the mornings for breakfast, you'd have them a bit more sweet. Um, for dinner and lunch, I have seasoned waffles and you can still have them sweet as well. And I serve them with whatever meat can I have ready at the moment. So fried chicken or probably seafood, lobster, shrimp. You can have it curry, brown stew, whatever, whatever you want. You just tell me and I'll look about it. Is this something that you've always wanted to get into? Is this something that you want to continue even after college life? Definitely, definitely. Um, I love cooking from a very young age and I wanted to get into it at, the, um, at third form back in high school. I was even going to do um, foods as a, as a subject. I, I didn't though. Um, I said that after university, I would officially like probably go to a Short, uh, short school, uh, the short courses in foods, but it's something I've always wanted to do. I've always dreamed about it. My parents you can ask them, they can tell you that from as long as they know me, it's always been about food. Um, do you plan to expand the business later on and plan for expansion? Um, getting staff involved and all of that stuff? Most definitely. Um, I've been talking to a few persons, um, encouraging me and teaching me along the way. And after my studies, um, my, my studies here at university doing engineering, I'm planning to do a master's and after my master's program, not sure what master's program I want to get into, but after my master's, I'll definitely move on to studying more professionally into foods and then moving from there to open up a, a restaurant for myself. 
some people think of work as a hustle but for me it's fun so it's more leisure for me when I'm working so I don't even think of it much as me spending a lot of time on a thing on a certain thing so balancing the schoolwork is it's almost 50 50 though the business the work it's almost there 50 50. Persons can reach me at my personal number that is 876-290-8700 or on Instagram they can hit me up um, DM me at Waffle Boss, that's W-A-H dot F-L-E underscore B-O-S-S. -S. After the break, it's Food Culture with Charlie Black and more. Ray and Neville, Food Culture, yo! New beginning, we winning, so share our spirit where you're living, yeah. Share it! I make we all our one bar, you don't know we come from far. From far, eh, eh. Anytime we read Food Country, ah. we're around, it's a big come with me. No matter with the bad vibes, who are we around a celebration time? We a Philly culture, we a make we sure, yeah. We Jamaican culture, we are nephew, overproof, and we just a dream to the culture.